Hey folks, my name is Rojo, and welcome back to the Guild of Dungeoneering. When we last left off, we just rescued our, uh, our friend, the, the uh, H2Omancer here. <laughs> Terrible puns. Anything else? Oh, yeah, there we go. And we also uh, completed an adventure in the process. This one? Ooh, the Black Pearl. Yeah, we, um... We did indeed get that, and actually, I forgot to look at the patch notes, so I apologize for that. But uh, we, uh, yeah, we're gonna start another uh, another adventure here, and I think we're gonna we're gonna go to Pirate Town because there's not much else to do aside from uh, some jungle stuff, which is fine as well. But uh, let's go to Copper Pot Dock, and uh, we'll bring Dizani here and see <laughs> what she can do for uh, for this first quest. I have my doubts as to whether or not I'm going to be able to make best use of this character. <laughs> Just because uh, cycling my own cards sounds... Eh, sounds not very good. <laughs> Just to be blunt. Alright, we've got a cabin boy, we've got a pirate, and a buccaneer. This guy's tough and spiky, he's got a lot of physical damage. Um, well... Do these guys have uh These guys are not part of the crew. Alright. So I think uh, we'll we'll put that guy down there, or and then do something like this to prevent this guy. I assume he's gonna chase us. So okay, wave we'll goodbye to you. Ugh. All right, Tekan, what you got? You got uh, what you got is a lot of damage, is what it appears to be. These tidal waves are gonna be like straight up useless to us. I think I'm gonna whirlpool here though, and uh, see what we can do. That thrash is. Bad effing news. <laughs> we might just straight up die here. I'm thinking the, the Hydromancer may not be the right character for the job here. Good lord! All the damage. Yeah. Yeah. Come gather round and listen now to our hero's epic tale. It was of an epic journey. <laughs> but also... This is interesting. So it looks like we need a new H2O Mancer. Time to put up some more for higher posters. Let's send someone else out while we wait. So that's an interesting change. So now uh, our Dungeoneers won't come back to us or we won't get a replacement immediately. And uh, that's okay because honestly, uh, the uh, yeah the H2O Mancer probably not the right choice for that particular adventure there. Uh, let's try again with somebody else. Uh, let's see. Mmm, we could do Drunken Sailor, we could... We haven't done our Alchemist in a while, but there's a lot of physical damage in there. Let's try our Barbarian. Let's... yeah, let's give that a shot. I don't think we play Barbarian in, in a little bit here, so... I think uh, Withstand is going to be an important card here. As well as just doing a shitload of damage uh, very quickly. Alright, we uh, unfortunately aren't going to be able to stop him from chasing us this time, but we will, will, will we put down this oarsman? Yeah, we will. Alright. Put down an oarsman, and uh, we'll see how we do. Should be able to kill him without too much trouble here. He's got, yeah, we got withstand right off the bat. This is going to be fine. This is going to be fine. He's got two damage coming at us, which is not enough to kill us, and he's going to kill himself anyway, so we'll just do that. Perfect. Already doing better than our poor H2O Mancer. Eyeball charm. That's okay. Ah, yeah, of course we want the spyglass, though, as a barbarian. That's a no-brainer. Stand still? I uh, don't think uh, don't think I'm gonna do that, actually. I think I'm gonna kill all your guys and take their stuff, and then I'm gonna kill you. Maybe. You can actually I'd feel okay about just making a path to this pirate over here. Um But uh unfortunately we don't <laughs> We don't have the right cards for that, so I guess I'll put that down at least. And uh, oh shit, I should have put a uh, should have put that guy back there though. That was a little bit of a misplay. That's okay though. It's okay. Head blow. Well, we don't have any blocking cards for physical, so I'm just going to get right up in this guy's grill <laughs> and uh, do what I can here. Headbutt is fine. I will uh, just do one of these, I guess. And we will kill him next turn with our overpower, so we don't need to worry about 
Anything, really. We'll just do one of those. He would even have killed himself, which would make our life a little bit easier. Alright, Seafarer's Brace is a good card. Crossbow is also a good card. The Anchor's not a bad card, but maybe not quite what we want here. I, I think I would rather have uh, this, because it gives us Retribution for all those assholes that deal a, a ton of damage, and uh, gives us Repel, which is a really good card to have. Okay, this guy's chasing us down pretty quickly. I need to be a little bit more careful now. Um, we can put this here, that's fine. And uh, we will fight a merman, and we'll remember to actually stop this guy's progress this time. Okay. Headbutts. Headbutts are fine. We can handle that. And, oh, since we're... That's a really interesting synergy. Since we damaged ourselves, we actually did our retribution damage. And since it's magic damage, um, he just took a shitload of damage, basically. So he's going to do three damage to us, so I'm just going to uh, do an assault here and kill him, actually. Yeah, I forgot we had the uh, spyglass. Okay. Glyph, no. Tricorn, yeah, probably. Actually, no, Skullcap. Yeah, Skullcap's really, really good. Gives us armor four. Oh, shoot. Terrible puns. Okay. Uh, we could probably fight one of these. This was a boss. This one has a lot less HP, though. Uh, and we don't really have the cards we would want to, uh, to go anywhere, so hopefully we'll get something next turn. <laughs> I'm thinking, though, maybe we, uh, if we get, if we can get to the pirate, we'll kill him, and then we'll turn back around if we have, uh, some pretty decent cards at that point. Let's see, um, I am just going to slam, so we're gonna... Oh, yeah, that's right, and then I have this, so I took three damage. <laughs> I'm gonna definitely continue to forget about that. Um, I will counter this one though, that seems fine. And a wave is, uh, it's not good. It's not good, but if we slam, he will die from retribution damage. Oh no, he won't because uh, this is an unblockable damage. A little bit of a misplay there, fair enough. Fair enough, but uh, we're still gonna win. Okay. Oh, the spike shield, though. Is it worth getting rid of range for the spike shield? I'm tempted to say yes, because we gain the spiky trait. We have a lot of defensive cards, and um, it gives us slice and dice, which are fine cards. Not like amazing blowing the doors off, but like they're pretty good. Mind staff? Yeah, we don't want the mind staff. We don't really want this either. I'm going to take the spike shield. I hate to get rid of uh, the ranged, but you know what? It's It's worth it, I think. Alrighty, we did get the card that we want, so I'm going to put a worm down here, and uh, we'll see how we do. Actually, I should put a pirate here, though, just to be safe. Although, actually, if that guy dies, that's probably going to buff this guy, isn't it? Should have thought about that. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Alright, we're going to do some, some nice damage to this guy right off the bat. And he's got stupidity coming at us, so I, <laughs> I guess we have to use assault here. And he's tenacious, so he can't be killed unless he's got 1 HP left. So we'll do a slam. And uh, next turn, we should be able to kill him. He's going to do pain. Uh, I'm going to withstand first. Just to make sure that we don't die here. <laughs> and he's got torment, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to overpower. Perfect. One dead worm. Give me a weapon. You did not give me a weapon. Feather cap's not bad. Masquerade mask actually isn't bad either, and neither is the conch. But um, I am going to stick with what we got. So let's see. Does this guy get buffed? Uh, maybe not because uh, he came after us too soon. That's possible. Okay, he's got a yoink. I don't think uh, I don't think I'm gonna let you do that actually. I forget that guy, this guy was going to try and chase us down. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'll shield wall that. And we'll get a little spiky in. Strike? Unfortunately, we can't do too much about here. Where, where's this mind strike coming from? Oh, yeah, the Seafarer's Brace, I think. Um, well. Let's get another card. That's fine. 
All right, this is going to kill him. <laughs> no doubt. <laughs> One very dead pirate. And I guess we can take the wing staff. I mean, we don't have a weapon yet, so... For now. It's not, like, great for us, but... It's good enough, I guess. Okay, let's uh, start turning around. If we actually turn around right now, we'll... Uh, We'll be able to fight this guy immediately. And I think we're probably strong enough to, to get it done. Alright, here we go. Actually, no, we won't fight him immediately. He's only gonna... Yeah, he's gonna be one square away. That's fine. That's fine. Charge, I will uh, just shield wall. And bite, I cannot shield wall, so I will... Uh, I think I'm just gonna do a, uh, an overpower here. Anger, again, I think I'll, yeah, we'll counter that, since we're not going to get that much, we wouldn't get the extra bonus damage from hurting ourselves. Splash, I guess we may as well use an Assault here, because this guy is going to die. Perfect. Hmm, do we want the Flintlock instead? It gives us Fury. I think we might want the Flintlock instead. Yeah, let's take it. I think it's a little bit better for us. All right, this guy's gonna come after us, and uh, I think we're uh, we're ready. So uh, well, actually, I guess we're gonna have to fight one more thing. Maybe let's. Uh, I don't know. We'll just we'll just put the this worm down here, and then he can come chase us down. Okay. Venomous Bite. Not a big fan, but uh, he's going to take a lot of damage here, so that's fine. And Stupidity is uh, also just fine here. Overpower. Torment. That's a lot of damage. We're going to do some damage back, though. Um, let me think about this. Yes, this will do two damage. Or so will this, actually. Or we could brace it. Uh, let's actually brace that. Get the spiky going. Actually, <laughs> brace would have been good for that, too. Um, this is a situation, though, where I'm just going to uh, do a slice, I think. And uh, next turn, we'll be able to kill this guy, I think. Pain is two damage. As long as we don't kill ourselves accidentally, we're going to be fine here. Perfect. A spear, you say? Spear's not bad. <clears throat> That's actually not bad either. Get rid of, uh... Get rid of Spiky and Shield Wall and all that, and we get Ignite and Firestorm and plus one HP. Ooh, that's tempting. That's really tempting, but I think I'm gonna stick with what we got. What about the Scale Mail? We lose Retribution and Mind Strike, but we gain plus two HP. Uh, no, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna take some gold. And uh, we'll fight this guy and see how we do. Reload! Not a big fan. But uh, I think this will be fine. We'll just go ahead and uh, ignore his uh, physical defense there. This is going to be a fair bit of damage. Which means we're going to do some damage back. So I guess I'm going to do a howl. And really uh, get up in his grill here. Another reload! Get out of here with that shit, man. Um, hmm. This is a little bit of a problem. We can't actually do any damage to him, so I'm going to do Assault. And uh, we're just going to take some spiky damage. Pummel is not good, but we can block 100% of this damage. And do some spiky of our own. There we go, he's got a head blow. That's actually probably worth repelling, honestly. <laughs> I hate, kind of hate to do it, but uh, we'll, we'll do some damage and we won't have to disc- Oh my god, so much damage. Well, I think it's time for us to probably do, uh, withstand. <laughs> We're gonna do some damage back, though, which is nice. We got, like, one turn to kill this guy now. We might not, might not win. Ooh, maybe, maybe with a shield wall we might win. Um, I'm going to do a slam here. Just because we can, and, uh, this guy's got, oh, yeah, he's got that. Hmm. 
Well, I think we have to shield wall. Yeah. And hopefully a buff card? Not a buff card. Oh, but we have counter. Ho oh, ho ho! That was very, very close. Very dangerous situation, but we've managed to prevail, if only barely. Well done. Hurrah, hurrah, a victory. That was so quick you made it look easy. This is a terrible ba battle scar. All right, so we got our uh, H2O answer back. This one should be named Poland. No relation to any water company, of course. And uh, yeah, that's going to do it for uh, for this episode. When we come back, we will uh, continue with the Copper Pot Doc adventure. And uh, maybe we'll give our, our new H2O answer a, uh, a try. And hopefully that'll work out a little bit better for him. But uh, yeah, until next time, my name has been Rojo. And thanks for watching.